Which shot? Uh, it's time for a transforming video. Okay, I'm gonna try and fit this in 10 minutes. Um, so here we have Transformers Cybertron Long Rack. Very nicely done. Um, uh, this part can move, which is pretty nice. Uh, let's see. He has his Cyber Planet key. Um, turns or activates his uh crush steel punch. Um I'm ah here we go. I had a hidden. Here's what it looks like. The silver Autobot kind and it goes in here. Let me push this and wow wow wow. So you can actually scoop up stuff with the movable thumb. Um, get, once you get a good look at them. Nicely done. Um, oops. That's not supposed to happen. It doesn't want to seem to stay. Um, I think one of my legs is damaged or something. Because it does not want to go as far as it needs to <clears throat> there we go so anyways um this part can rotate 360 degrees which is nice um this thing can move up or down which is to be expected and it can also rotate 360 degrees which is kind of I think pretty cool um out about some wool so, for transformation, the head goes up, it's a ball joint head, so we'll rotate it around, um, take these, push them outwards, go to the back, and get it, disconnect these, and then uh, leave these like this, and pull this around and then unconnect it like so Oop. and I'll bring my camera up a bit higher um maybe it's not high enough anyways uh some Next thing we need to do is take this one and rotate it around. Push down the thumb, push down the hand. Here we have a long rack. Not long arm, but long rack. You only see him stuck in the mud, and then you see what he transforms into in the beginning. Like, the first episode. Um, really neat figure. He has a lot of posability. His gun, well, right there. Uh, mini butt holder there. Here's his strength detail. I'm trying to hold it as steady as possible. Hope you got that. Um, he's patient. He doesn't like to fight. Um, although he will fight, and he's as tough as a mountain. So, pretty cool. Um, like I said, the thumb can move. So he actually picks stuff up uh, for. Articulation, this arm rotates 360 degrees, the shoulder moves out, and then this thing rotates 360 degrees, which I already explained that. Um, and this can move out like that, and then rotate 360 degrees, 360 degrees at the upper elbow, Oops. and then bends at the upper elbow, and then the thumb and stuff can move. Uh, the waist can rotate 360 degrees around, the legs can move up like this and out like that. They can move. The knees can move like this and then the feet can well yeah. <laughs> um so I'm gonna put them in a cool pose. Make it look like he's grabbing something. 
So, a uh, really neat looking figure. Um, his main color, yellow, uh, a brownish, a little lighter brown, black, and red. With gray, if I didn't say that. And then a little bit of gold or mustardish. Um, for some reason, this color seems to be different than this color, but that doesn't make any better. And I'm going to zoom in on the head. The head looks really, really nice. I think, anyways. Um, looks like you're, you know, very good Autobot head. Um, I give this figure about five stars. Two thumbs up. Um, I really do like this figure. Um, he's really fun to mess with. Um, I recommend getting him. Mm -hmm. Five out of five, um, two thumbs up, like I said, you should get him because he's a really neat figure.